everybody. I am going to start by showing you um, some past videos. Oh, I think I showed this, but it is now dry and it's got my, my guy in it. Um, but I love the colors of that one. And then this is the Slice and Swipe. Um, turned out way cool. I like it. And then this is the big um, flip and drag. Uh, got some really cool stuff going on. I did use silicone in this. Try not to make you dizzy by moving it. Look at all that webbing. Making myself dizzy though. Oh my god. It's like the eye and a smiling like lizard creepy thing. Um, now this part you can tell a little bit it's just well, actually, if you didn't know, you wouldn't know that it wasn't there originally. Um, there was, and this was probably like 18 hours into drying, um, this had become like one big ugly cell. So I took some white from the drip pan and I went like this. Um, and it was, since the paint was tacky, because uh, it was half dry, I wondered how it would dry. And it is perfectly smooth, which astounded me. I thought for sure that I had ruined it. Um, but since the painting's so busy anyways, um, it blends right in. But it was good to know that it dried like that because it was really um, bumpy because the paint was, as I said, pretty tacky. Um, yeah, that one took a while to dry. Uh, maybe two days because it was so thick. Um, and, you know, a larger... And also it had been poured on before and then gessoed. So when you do that, uh, the canvas does not absorb as much because it's not, you know, the raw canvas. Alrighty, I'm going to do a balloon smash. But I'm gonna, I've done it different ways. I've done it where it's more like my stamp technique where I have another thing with the paint and I stamp. But I think this, I'm just going to make puddles and do it directly onto it. So I've got Liquitex Basic Primary Blue, Yellow, and Soho Permanent Red. This is a 12 by 12 inch canvas, uh, level 3 from Michaels. And I guess yesterday they had buy one get two free um, for that day only, and I missed it. And I need to start checking. I used to check the app all the time to find out. Um, and I haven't been. And I have very few canvases left. So I need to start. So this is my house paint with low troll and water. Um, this is what I use. It works well. Um, this I have also used, and it works really well, and this is from Michaels, and it says flow acrylic, so, but it's almost the same consistency as their tube paint, um, but flow troll and water as well with this. that need to be varnished. I'm looking at them right now. I have like 20 of them. And I really, really, really need to varnish them because I have no room left for any others to dry. And I need 
need to list them on Etsy. And I believe that my coupon and 300 is still, a, <laughs> you can still use that on Etsy. I don't think I ever turned it off. And I think that was like 20% off. I now honestly can't remember. But give it a whirl. And if it doesn't do it, email me. And I'll get it taken care of. My email is in the video description, but it's pretty easy. It is Ann at AnnOsborneArt.com. Um, so it's pretty hard to forget. up corners and sides. So update on me looking for a dog. I have filled out. I have like, I'm working with like three different rescues um, to find the perfect one. So I've been filling out applications. Um, my friends have been giving references. My vet has, um, and I have one of them coming out to the house tomorrow for a home visit. So I don't even get to meet a dog yet. So they've got to check out my house. Um, and it's, you know, going through rescues is a really long process. But all my dogs that I've gone through rescues with, hey, those are, that's weird, have been the most amazing dogs ever. So totally worth the wait, but yet when you want a dog, you know, you just really want a dog. I mean, I have a good dog right now, but actually maybe uh, may, you know, I may just dump this on the balloon. See how that works. Yeah, I seem to be taking, look, happy birthday, with this dog thing. I'm like, that's all I can think about. Maybe it's so I don't think about my son going off to college in a week. Two weeks, I guess. But it's a serious thing adopting a dog, so you got to take your time. All right, that is a big mess. circle, I usually am just like blotting it. A little bit more yellow. Whoa, maybe not that much. Not loving that. And then I think I'm going to use that.
is getting so slippery. That's why this is probably not the preferred method. Because <laughs> it's kind of ridiculous. <laughs> but it's fun. It's a fun method. Tilting up here, get up here, get that how I want it, and then, um, yeah, that's kind of a hot mess. Well, is it? Maybe it isn't. same way. Just in the squeeze bottle. paper towel. But I'm going to actually pour it to the side now because I really would be sad if I dumped paint on this right now. Please tell when I'm concentrating when I stop talking. <laughs>
this torch and see what happens. I still like this side way better than this side. did that because I was not entirely happy with it. <clears throat> this might be a good thing. I like how it's coming together. Part shirt got weird, didn't it? It's nice that that part seems to be moving and the side by me is not changing too much. really cool actually. I wasn't sure about it. Do I want to try again on this side? It's the whole thing. Because I sure could. And I am. I need to go for another shot. Because if you are not happy with it, there is no point in not trying to fix 
fix it. As I say, it's just paint. it occurred to me that the part that I like the best is the very first place that I did it and the balloon was clean at that point. They're pretty on that balloon. I love this color combo. It's always a good one. Well, now I like this side better than that one. I got it. And boy, oh boy, is this balloon gorgeous. I have to take pictures of the balloon. First, the balloon. Amazing. So, so pretty. All right, now for the painting. Very pretty as well. This side is pretty too. That area is kind of cool. The side is way cool. I'm very happy with it. And I'm so glad I wiped off the part I wasn't. So thank you so much for watching, and I will catch you all next time. Bye.